Hello all and welcome back to our course Primavera P6, the advanced course that will cover a complete construction for a bridge. And today we'll talk about adding the resources, estimating the quantities, productivity rates, checking the bill of quantities, and the draw. We have identified three types of resources, which are equipment, personnel, and the material in P6. And we have to add uh, duration of the activities. So for excavations, if you have one excavator and the excavator can do 100 cubic meter a day. So the abutment excavation quantities is 1000 divided by 100 give you 10 days. And for bent, you have 800 divided by 100 give you eight days. So the duration is what? Quantity of work and you divide it by number of crews and how much crews can do. If you have two excavators, can do 200, means the abutment excavation equal 1,000 divided by 200 give you how much? Five days, okay? Full footing, okay? If you have a pump and batching plant that can produce 100 cubic meters of concrete a day, and your abutment footing is 1,500 cubic meters divided by 100, which is the productivity, it will give you 15 days. For bent, the same, I have 800 cubic meters divided by 100, give me eight days. How I can get these quantities? You will have a quantity tick off. You can check the, your bill of quantities and also you can check the drawing and sit with your estimating team to get all these quantities, okay? Any questions, guys, send it to me. This is very important lectures. Also for the abutment, you have abutment column, sorry. After you do the footing, you're going to do the column. So I have 2,000 cubic meters divided by 100. Give me 20 days. For the bent column, I have 1,800 divided by 100. Give me 18 days. It's easy. Take off quantities divided by the number of crews and how much each crews will do. For the precast beam, after you do the footing and then you're putting the column, you're going to put the precast beam. You will need a heavy crane and, uh, and a team of work. The crane can do four beams a day, and I have 20 beams in each direction. So 20 beams divided by how much each crew can do for give me five days. So each direction will take five days to place the precast beam. Okay, easy. For the superstructures, okay, you know we have two spans and every span you uh, have around 500 cubic meter of concrete and also we still have the same batching plant pump which can do 100 cubic meter a day. That's mean I will divide 500 which comes from the design drawing or FEC or the shop drawing divided by 100. I will need to place the superstructures uh, five days in each direction. Okay, I hope you guys like these lectures. You found it easy. Any questions, send it to me. And then we can elaborate more once we start adding the durations and the resources to P6. Have a great day. Stay tuned and energize yourself for the next coming lectures, which is going to be very interesting about earned value, adding the resources to P6, adding quantities and durations. Uh, going to be more and more interesting course. Stay tuned, guys. Thanks so much.